Hello dear students, myself Dr. Vishwamar Mandi and uh, today we will discuss a NEET problem that is a NEET is asked in the NEET 2021 basic upon the basic in the chapter electrostatics and dipole actually this the dipole is placed in an electric field as shown in figure in which direction the dipole will move in which direction the dipole move we will discuss it okay whether first of all know whether this electric field is uniform or non-uniform you know that the when the electric field is uh, parallel the line surface is parallel and this gives us to uniform electric fields because the number of line surface crushing per unit area is perpendicular to gives us to do the magnitude of electric fields so the line surface per unit area gives rise to the magnitude of the electric field so this is the represent the uniform electric field and the, when the this is the equispace uniform this is the uniform electric field and when the electric field is a non uniform not equispace that is non that is not equispace it represents the non uniform electric field and this charge must be positive as it is diverging the electric field is diverging is this charge must be positive so this is the case of non uniform electric field and uh, in this situation and the dipole is placed in a non uniform electric field because uh, the electric field is diverging so it, that means uh, it indicates that the positive charge must be present at this point otherwise it is not diverging so when the dipole is placed in this uh, non uniform electric field and uh, it will experience uh, in which direction it will move you know that the electric field starts from when you go away from this uh, the electric field is decreasing away from this side the electric field is decreasing on the left side this let it be e1 and the right side let it be e2 so e1 must be greater than e2 in the left side this is a, in the left side of the dipole the electric field is e1 on the right side the dipole it is e2 so e1 is greater than e2 so positive charge will expense a force it will away it will positive positive repulsive force away so the, as the electric field is e1 in this in this side is e1 so it will expense a force e1 q towards a right and uh, it is positive and this is the, because the line support starts from higher to lower plus positive to negative charge so as the negative it is it is a negative so it will expense a force towards uh, left it be towards left because it is negative and positive attractive force so definitely it will move towards left try to move towards left as and it will ex the force is f2 is equal to as the electric field on the right side is e2 that is why the force will e2 into q and we have calculated the force on the charge plus q and that force is equal to f1 is equal to that is equal to e1 into q and the force on minus q charge will be f2 is equal to e2 into q okay as the electric field e1 on the left side of the dipole is greater than the electric field on the right side you know that the electric field from left side more than the right side so even f1 since e1 is greater than e2 so f1 must be greater than f2 so the dipole will expense a force towards right and this minus q charge the plus q charge expense a force towards right and minus q charge will expense a force towards left as e1 greater than e2 so f1 must be greater than f2 so the dipole will move towards right one one answer is that the dipole is move towards right hence the dipole next question is that uh, in which direction whether the dipole move from higher potential as to lower potential that we have to know it okay how you know that the, the dipole moment suppose you know there is a suppose this is a minus q charge and plus q charge and this is a dipole moment p and this electric field in this direction is net the dipole moment is p and the electric field in this direction e so 
this angle between the electric field and the dipole moment is 180 degree. This emits net electric fields. That is the net electric in this direction, suppose. And uh, the, 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 you know that the potential energy when the dipole is placed in the electric field, it will, the potential energy dipole is equal to minus P dot T. So minus P dot T means this electric field means uh, net electric field. That is uh, net electric means uh, E is equal to E1 plus E2. As the dipole is in the electric field E1 and E2, the electric field is varying from positive in, in the side of the positive charge E1 and, and I have taken and the, in the side of negative charge will be E2. So net electric field will be E1 plus E2. So that is why E1 plus E2 that is mean minus P dot E and P. E and P, the angle is 180 degree, that is E is equal to minus P E cross 180. That is equal to plus P E. As the dipole moment is constant, so U proportional to P is constant. And uh, U proportional to E. Since uh, E1 greater than E2 show which is the potential energy potential energy on the left side E1 on the right side is E2 E1 greater than E2 so the dipole will move from higher potential to lower potential so dipole to if the dipole is placed in, a, in this electric field all uniform electric field the dipole move towards right and on the left side, the poten as E1 is greater than E2, so the e potential energy on the left side is greater than potential on the right side. So the dipole will move from left side to the right side and move towards right. Thank you very much.